Welcome young ocean explorers. Today we're diving into the mysterious and incredible ocean zones. We'll explore the sunlight zone, the twilight zone, and the midnight zone to discover the amazing marine life and their unique adaptations. Get ready to learn all about the secrets hidden deep in the ocean. First, let's start with the sunlight zone, also known as the epipelagic zone. This is the top layer of the ocean, extending from the surface down to about 200 meters. It's called the sunlight zone because it receives plenty of sunlight, making it the warmest and brightest part of the ocean. Sunlight is essential here because it allows photosynthesis to happen. Tiny plants called phytoplankton use sunlight to produce oxygen and food, forming the base of the ocean's food chain. This process is why the sunlight zone is bustling with life. You'll find all sorts of marine creatures here like fish, sea turtles, and dolphins swimming through vibrant coral reefs. Warm temperatures and plenty of light make this zone perfect for many animals and plants to thrive. Remember, this is where the ocean is full of life because of the sunlight, photosynthesis, and the creatures that live here. Now, we dive deeper into the twilight zone or the mesopelagic zone, which ranges from 200 to 1000 meters deep. It's a darker and cooler place because only a little sunlight can reach this far. The creatures here have to be creative to survive in the dim light. Many of them have adapted with bioluminescence, which means they can produce their own light. Isn't that cool? Fish like lanternfish and jellyfish glow in the dark to communicate, find food, or even escape predators. Some animals here have large eyes to capture the faint light, while others glow to confuse or attract prey. You might also hear about a special daily journey some animals make called vertical migration. Many twilight zone creatures swim up to the sunlight zone at night to feed and then return to the deep during the day to stay safe. The twilight zone is a place of mystery, where dim light and glowing creatures make it one of the most fascinating parts of the ocean. Now, let's dive even deeper into the midnight zone, also known as the bathypelagic zone. This zone begins at 1,000 meters and goes down to 4,000 meters. Here, it is pitch black because sunlight cannot reach this depth. It's also freezing cold and the pressure is extremely high. Life in the midnight zone is tough, and only the hardiest creatures can survive here. Animals like the anglerfish use bioluminescence to lure prey in the complete darkness. With no sunlight for photosynthesis, the creatures in this zone rely on something called marine snow for food. Marine snow is made up of tiny bits of organic material, like dead plankton and other matter, that fall from the upper layers of the ocean. This snow is an essential source of nutrients for the deep-sea creatures. In the midnight zone, animals have adapted to these extreme conditions. Some have slow metabolisms to conserve energy, while others can withstand the immense pressure and icy temperatures. It's a dark, mysterious world, but one that is crucial to the ocean's overall health. And that, young explorers, is the journey through the ocean's incredible zones, from the sunlit coral reefs teeming with life, through the glowing mysteries of the twilight zone, and into the dark depths of the midnight zone. Each zone has its own unique characteristics and amazing creatures. Now that you know all about the ocean zones, you're ready to take on the challenges in the escape room adventure. Remember to use this video as your field guide if you ever need help. For more interactive educational escape rooms and a chance to earn free dig kits, visit excavatingadventures.com. Dive in and keep exploring the wonders of science.